welcome back to my channel I know it's a bit too late it is already mid-July today but I always believe in the saying it is better late than never so hence welcome to my June favorite so today I'm going to share with you the products that I've been loving the past month or the month of June but some of them I am still using up to this very day I will show you in a bit why because of the, it's summer here and for the summer my goal is to keep and maintain my hair as healthy as they could I don't know it's hard because of the Sun um, and my skin and all that stuff but yeah so without further ado let's begin so first up are these two products from Garnier Fructis. I really love these. This one has been my holy grail ever since I discovered this a few months back. I don't remember when, but I do have a video on this one. I really like this Garnier Fructis bandage or damage eraser split it bandage. I do have a lot of split ends. I used to have a lot of split ends, but now I can see a total difference. This already helps reconstruct as well those uh, my ends that are already damaged and prevents from uh, from also having more split ends. So now, even if I'm under um, under the sun most of the time, we go to the park, go to the playground. I I use this just so I can protect my hair from the sun and I have lesser. I can see that I have lesser uh, split ends right now. And also, I discovered that they do have this one right here. This is also a damage eraser, but it's called the Strength Reconstructing Butter. It's like a buddy butter you know buddy butter for your body or for your skin but this one is a butter for your hair so you just leave this on um, it says here the this rich indulgent butter is designed to intensely reconstruct hair strength for strong rejuvenated and shiny looking hair so I really like it I, after I shampoo my hair I live I use this and I leave this on for about 10 to 15 minutes uh, depending on how much I would take me to actually scrub my entire body and all that stuff and then I would just rinse this and after that I follow this up with a split and bandage and that's it and of course if I am going to use any um, if my, I'm going to curl my hair or if I'm straighten my hair of course you also have to use your hair protectant hair protectant spray so that's it these two are my favorites for my hair so it's Garnier Fructis damage eraser one is the split and bandage and the other one is the spring reconstructing butter so the next product that I'm going to share with you guys is something different. This is not a makeup product. This is not a hair mask or anything. It's a multivitamins that I uh, take right now. I don't know if you call it multivitamins, but I, I started taking this in the beginning of June just because I have noticed my nails has been chipping a lot. They're very brittle. After I gave birth to two kids, I have seen or have noticed that my nails have been really brittle. So I research on this. I see a lot of YouTubers are they recommend to um, take this or they take this. So I tried it out myself, and I so far really I like it. My nails are not as brittle as they were before, and of course I see like with the help of my hair products. It also helped my hair. I think it's helping my hair to grow faster. I've seen, I'm not sure if it might, it might be a placebo effect, but I think really it mostly it helps my nails. So if you guys are looking for a vitamin, like a natural vitamin to help you with, to strengthen your nails, I would recommend you try this. It's, er, I don't think there's any chemicals in this. I'm not quite sure. Don't quote me like what I said. I'm not a doctor. I'm not a health professional. I just... Okay, it says here that it's supposed to help the body to maintain carbohydrates, fats, and proteins. And is a factor in the maintenance of good health. So I don't see anything negative on that. So I tried it and I like it. Biotin is from Nature's Bounty. It's about $10. Not quite sure how much it was. But I know I got it from Walmart. I will just put the link down below of the exact price or exact retail price. But yeah, I got it from Walmart. I'm sure you can get it from any drugstore. So if you guys want to try it, I recommend it to you. The next one is part of my skincare routine. It is the Free Man Feeling Beautiful. <laughs> Feeling beautiful. Um, Sparkling Fair Pore Cleansing Mask. I have been trying to minimize my pores. I do have a little um, visible pores on this area of my skin. So this one has really been helping me. I use this twice a week. Um, this is about 
less than five dollars i got this from walmart and since i got it last month i have been religiously using this um as you know if you if you're like me if you see visible pores or like large pores on this side it doesn't look good especially if you're someone who doesn't really like i like what i been saying in my past videos i'm not really uh um a heavy i don't really like to use heavy foundation or um i don't use foundation very often i tend to use bb cream most of the time um so if you use a bb if uh, you if you are a bb cream user like me you guys know that Sometimes BB cream they don't have a they have they really have like coverage so hence they can you can totally see your skin right so anyway I'm talking too much but yeah this is helping my pores my visible pores and if you guys are looking for one that's really affordable you might want to try this with so the next one would be these two from Rimmel London it's a stay matte primer and a Rimmel London BB cream matte this is the nine in one skin perfecting super makeup yes it is a super makeup i really like this and yeah since i discovered these two they have been my perfect combination so yeah i've been loving these the stay matte primer holds my makeup in place holds the bb cream in place eight hours i go to work no problem at all i go somewhere else no problem i use this it my makeup stays intact this one the, the bb cream it says it's a matte yes it really mattifies my skin I have been using this, I swear, since May, if I'm not mistaken, since I got this in May or April. I have been really loving this. I am not a foundation girl or like I don't use foundation most of the time. I like BB creams and uh, CC creams and this has been one of my favorite BB creams so far. So yeah, I forgot how much they retail for but I'm pretty sure each one is less than $10. Like what I said, I'm just going to put the link of the retail price down below. I just got these. These two I got from Shoppers Drug Mart um shoppers yeah from shoppers drug mart it's like it's like a cvs walgreens here in canada so yeah they are available in any of the drug stores near you so if you guys are looking for a primer and or a bb cream for to use this summer you might as well want to try these two so yeah they are my perfect combination this one from essence surprisingly i really really like this product from essence i don't know if you guys have tried this but yeah this one is the essence all about matte this is a fixing compact powder i use this every day as well i just when i after i put on my um my bb cream i just dab a little bit of this just so that i know it seals up the the, the, the the my concealer my bb cream and all that stuff so yeah i use this to also if i don't feel like if i'm just at home and i don't want to look like a grease ball i just use this and it mattifies my face so yeah if you guys are looking for a good and affordable uh compact powder or uh, face powder you may want to try this essence all about that. last but not the least is this palette from the benefit cosmetic it's called the rocky tooth i've been using this almost every day uh, during the past month and even up to today everything is just right here for the summer like what i say i don't wear a lot of makeup during the summer so this one is actually my go-to one it has the benefit i use it for my blush it has the high beam if i want some um if i want to highlight the high points on my cheeks the bridge of my nose you know the cupid's bow i use this one and then it also has this uh blush but i don't really use this as much it's not as pigmented as i want it to be so i just stick to the benetint one so that my cheeks just give it just give, gives my cheeks that natural blush so i really really like this this is actually my favorite and then it also has this lip gloss it can, this one comes with um this um tips and tricks where it tells you how to use each and every one of them but i just stick to these two right here the benetint and the high beam and i am good to go so if you guys i don't know i forgot how much i bought this i got this from sephora 
a while back and I think it's less than $30 I'm not quite sure I will put a link down below like what I said for the retail price of everything that I mentioned in this video so that's it for my June favorites I hope you guys like this video and if you do please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up you can share this video too if you want to I would highly appreciate it and also if you are not subscribed yet to my channel I suggest I suggest I hope that you hit that red button that says subscribe up there it's so easy anywho i hope you guys have a good rest of your week a good rest of your day and i will talk to you guys later